Uh, hello traders, uh, today is the 9th of April uh, 2010 and I want to do a quick video about the psychology part of the trading. Uh, how to make uh, excellent trading decision like professional traders, okay? There are various uh, causes that uh, affect the, the decision of uh, a trader, okay? And uh, one of them that uh, I want to talk about or stress uh, on today is uh, the previous losses, okay? So, if you are trading and then uh, you lose, and then you lose again, and then you lose, and maybe you have a uh, five losing trade in a row, definitely that will affect you. Okay, I know that you know. So when you you are trading, okay, and then you enter a trade, and suddenly your trade is profitable, okay, and uh, you fail to move your stop quickly to break even, and the trade uh, trade against you, and uh, and becomes a, a losing trade that also will affect you okay i know that you know so that can affect you also uh, maybe a computer failure or your broker mistake also affect you and you miss one good opportunity that also may affect you okay or a lack of concentration that make you make a wrong decision by clicking on the wrong uh, security you want to maybe buy the euro usd but you click on the the euro gbp okay or you want to sell the the apple but uh, the apple but you click on selling google okay and those mistakes are happening all the time to every trader okay but when this thing happen you need to know uh, the course of action you need to take okay so the first thing to do is is to look at it and know that okay I've made a mistake and uh, remind yourself that this is common thing happening to all the traders all over the world. So if you are trading in your office or in your home or wherever you are, you're looking at the screen, just remind yourself that this thing that is happening to you now is happening to millions of traders right now. Okay? It doesn't matter uh, your experience in trading. Even the professional traders at one point we make a mistake but what i found very difficult to deal with myself in the past uh, was uh, to deal with uh, um, the loss plus a missing opportunity okay let me explain myself a loss plus a missing opportunity so you are trading okay and then you have a winning trade okay and you feel you fail to take profit out of that trade okay it was a good trade it was a successful trade but you did not manage the trade very well and suddenly that opportunity uh, has become lost okay and then you lose that uh, uh, your your trade okay first you see the profit on your screen you were happy about it and the next thing boom you lose it okay and this can affect you the whole day you are sitting on your desk thinking only about that particular trade and you are thinking of it and say oh if i did take my profit quickly if i take this course of action i will be uh, better off or uh, this will not have happened okay and uh, this will be playing on your mind for some time and uh, it will affect you to make your decision the second one i want to talk about is miss missing miss opportunity miss opportunity okay you miss opportunity because um, of lack of concentration or maybe you are on your computer the whole day waiting for a trade setup okay and for one reason or another the telephone is ringing you went to take the telephone call you were on the phone talking to your best mate okay having a good laugh okay and the next thing you come back that trading opportunity is gone okay and you start kicking the table kicking yourself blaming everything and say oh why this can happen to me and this can play on your mind the whole day okay another thing also that can affect you also the decision of trading is when you are sitting on your desk waiting for uh, your trade to you know that your decision is very very good decision you are very confident of your trade okay but for one way or another uh, something happened and the trend become a loss a losing trade okay only later on that the same uh, setup uh, the price turn around again and away in the direction that you were expecting okay so you you want to sell you sell first okay but for one reason or another the price went 
went up further up okay and then you, you take your stuff out okay you are taken out of your train okay and you are a bit confused you see why this can happen because you make all your your, your research you plan your trade carefully you enter your trade uh, at the right time okay but for one reason the price uh, moves to the opposite direction and your trade has become a losing trade okay and then few minutes later the price turned around and did exactly what you were expecting the price to do okay and uh, this can affect your trading decision but uh, in trading we want to avoid all the emotional uh, if effect on our, our mind we want to have a clear mind we want to be able to make excellent decision what are called intelligent decision okay very analytical decision we don't want to be making decision based on the emotion or past mistake or past error or any other thing we want to make a clear valid decision uh, according to uh, the chart pattern and the time of the day and the news that are happening looking at the the higher time frame the daily chart the five days uh, weekly chart okay so that's why i say to you apart from your technical knowledge okay or your fundamental knowledge okay there are the the the, the, the main element in your success uh, in your success in trading is yourself how are you going to control yourself after you lose after you lose how are you going to move from there to to achieve your goal to to, to make a profit or to become a successful trader this is it so a lot of traders go through all sorts of emotional during their trading day okay and a lot of things are happening okay a lot of delay sometimes because you're expecting your profit to be fast you want to come out and they're dragging your feet dragging your feet dragging your feet the market was so slow and uh, you you end up closing your position when you were fed up really because you, f you couldn't cope anymore you don't want to wait the whole day for this only trade okay you sit in your desk waiting waiting and it's just going on slowly slowly and you get fed up and you close your trade as soon as you close your trade and uh, the price moves exactly to the direction you were expecting and you're sitting there looking at uh, the screen and thinking that oh what was all this okay you're thinking that the whole world is against you okay because at the same time you enter the, the you close that particular trade the price starts moving fast okay and you're looking you're thinking of all the profit you could have made if you didn't close that decision but who made that decision it's yourself who made that decision to close the trade once you made a decision to close it that's it don't look back again it's done it's done it's finished okay so these are the things that is affecting uh, a lot of traders every day in their trading okay or some days you wake up and you have a, a nice trade okay everything went perfectly and uh, you know that okay uh, it's lunchtime now uh, it's uh, 12 uh, a.m eastern time uh, it's lunchtime now the market will go into a siding position you should close your trade but there was this excellent uh, trading setup that you don't want to miss and you enter that trade and because of that you lose all your hardware of the whole morning this also can affect you okay but the main thing to remember is that uh, when those things happen you, you you have to look at it a, a bit maybe detach yourself from it which is not easy uh, if uh, I have to be honest with you it's not easy to detach yourself from it but you try to detach yourself from it and uh, maybe you you spend too much time on one particular stock on one particular currency on one particular commodity you you try to look at other opportunity okay or maybe you should take a day off okay go away from the computer come back another time in most cases you know that uh, this is not the best time to trade and sometimes we force ourselves to trade okay i hope this video also help you to improve your trading in order to avoid making uh, um, emotional decision okay till next time enjoy yourself and be very very happy thank you